Well, they are going for an even 20. The Duggar family from the TLC show 19 and Counting announced today that Michelle Duggar, the mom, is pregnant with her 20th child. Generally speaking, I've always been a huge fan of large families. As a kid, I always wanted to be a part of a large family. I have lots and lots of cousins. I'm one of only two, but in my family, my aunts and uncles have 10, they've got nine, they've got seven kids. My mom was one of seven kids. I always wanted to be a part of a huge family, but I think you might agree with me that 20 is larger than the average large family. And I think that, you know, my question is, when you start to have that many children, how do you spend good quality time with them? I've seen the Duggars uh, attempt to answer that question in the sense that uh, that they try to spend one-on-one -on -one time, whether it's at the grocery store or um, that it's not just the older kids raising the younger kids. But I would think that with that many children in your family that your older kids, the oldest of which is 23 who doesn't live at home anymore uh, because he has his own family now. But how do you work that out that you are getting good quality time with your with your younger kids? I suppose that's my my biggest question or it would be my biggest concern. Now, in the grand scheme of things, this is absolutely not an issue that pertains to my family whatsoever, but it's something that definitely makes me curious and it is one of the reasons that that we have a smaller family. It's important to me that I get lots of time with both of my kids individually. But I know that families that have three and four and five and seven kids get lots of time with their kids too. But once you get into the neighborhood of 15 and 16 and 17 kids, do you end up relying more on your older children to help raise your younger children? Or do you manage to get that good quality time with your younger kids? And as a sidebar, I do find it curious that the Duggars are bothered by criticism of them deciding to have more children. I think that when you make your living off a reality television show and you choose to make your birth announcements on live television, that you sort of open yourself up to that, wouldn't you think?